Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we're always and forever evolving. Hello, Libra. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Libra. I hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful temple of yours, Libra. Of course, as it takes care of you. Welcome back, Libras. Come on in. Today's topic here is going to be the person here, Libra, that is on your mind. Yes, we're going to see how they feel towards you. What are some things? What are some things that they want to say to you right now? Right. And most importantly, what messages do your spirit team here has for you regarding the person here today that is on your mind? All right. So come on in, get comfortable. Shout out to the Soul Tribe. Thank each and every one of you all for your continuous love and support here. It is an honor to have you here with me and evolve and ride along with me on this spiritual journey. Thank you so much, Soul Tribe, for your continuous love and support. All right. And welcome, Libra, to the ones that are new here. It's also a pleasure to have you all. Thank you so much for your comments and your feedback down below. I see you and I hear you in those comments. And most of all, I appreciate you. All right. Definitely don't forget to subscribe. We would love to have you, Libra, a part of our soul family here as well. And be sure to adjust your notification bells for when I go live on this platform. I do go live throughout the week for all Zodiac sign readings. If you would love to stop by and get a check-in, Libra, before you get your day started for Wake and Tarot, I also go live for separate live streams for questions. If you have a question that you would love to ask Tarot as well through the assistance of my ancestors and myself, all right? So definitely be sure to set your bell so you don't miss out on any new content that I post on this channel, all right? So no further ado, Libras, let's go ahead and dive in. Let's see about the person here today that is on your mind and what do they want to say and what do you just need to know about this person? Wow, we have the Wheel of Fortune here. Sagittarius energy here, Libra. Some of y'all, this person may be an archer or it could be a Leo or an Aries here, but particularly this is Sagittarius energy. All right, some of you all may be dating a Sagittarius, exchanging energies with the Sagittarius. I've noticed a lot of Sagittarius energy or fire element in your readings lately. All right, for the ones that are exchanging energies with the Sagittarius or dating a Sagittarius here. Whatever situation or circumstance here with this fire sign or whomever this energy here is for you, there is going to be a situation or opportunity where it's going to come back around full circle, meaning that you and this person is going to be able to get another opportunity or go at this connection or relationship here. Okay, at least this is how this person feels. And from what intuitively, obviously the divine here is bringing an opportunity in as well. Now it is your free will, it's your free choice. I'm not telling you what to do here, Libra. I'm just here reading the cards, okay? Uh, we know the Jupiter energy talks about good luck, good fortune, good things that are coming your way. All right, so let's see what else here. We're going to clarify that card as well to get more insight, particularly on what that may be for you as well, okay? Let's see what else about this person here on your mind. Wow, we got justice. All right, this is your energy here, Libra. This is your card, your energy every day, all day. All right, needing and wanting justice for the way that you may was treated in this situation here, Libra, from this person in the past. So this is where it indicates with that Will of Fortune card here on how the justice or how things are literally here about to work out in your favor. So whatever this opportunity that's coming back around for you and this person or just overall you being able to receive the, um, the opportunity to be treated now in a situation where it's going to work out in your favor because whatever may be in the past or however that didn't work out in your favor with this person or the way that you were treated here unfairly this could be either this person coming back to give you that justice to treat you the right way here or vice versa someone else could be coming in to give you the justice that this person didn't do for you in the past on how you done towards this person and gave them the energy the effort the time the love into that connection and if they wasn't given back given even exchange 
Again, this could be someone else, someone new coming in to make up for what that person didn't do towards for you in the past. Okay, so again, take it how it resonates. I'm getting a lot of different downloads and information for you. All right, so definitely take what applies and leave here what doesn't. All right, Libra. I also heard Aquarius Aqua energy as well. Some of y'all, this person could be Aquarius here, or again, they could be an air sign like yourself as a Libra, a Gemini, again, Aquarius. And we also have Sagittarius energy here as well. All right, let's see what the future outcome here is for you too. The hard fun. Wow, Taurus energy here, Libra. Some of y'all, this person here could be a Taurus. Now, I want you to notice on how we have three major arcana cards so this situation or circumstance for whomever that this is resonating for this was certainly not by accident okay so whatever this experience has led to up into this day libra this was not by accident okay this is something that was being orchestrated or designed by the universe okay because there is not one card out here that's just not the original card that was uh, designed in a deck. These are all considered major arcana cards, which is major um, placements in the universe that takes effect when there are situations and circumstances that need to be assisted on this earth. And so your angels is definitely on this case, on this situation, whatever you want to call it for yourselves. But this is definitely something that's not happening by accident. Now, I see the two of swords here at the bottom of the deck. That's also your element, your energy, Libra. This could be you kind of guarding yourself, not so much putting in no more of the time or effort into this situation here because of the way that you feel like that you were treated in this situation, which is very understandable, right? Um, I only understand what you are processing here. And I can only imagine with our major three corner cards coming out here. All right, so let's get more clarity pertaining to this situation and circumstance here for whomever needs the clarity here. Wow, powerful reading here for you, Libra. Duffy, if this is resonating for you, again, hit that big fat thumbs up, Libra. All right, show my ancestors some love for the deliverance of the messages here today. Let's clarify the cards here to get more insight on this particular situation here, okay? Again, these are general readings, so take care of what resonates and leave here what doesn't okay clarify the will of fortune here for my libra we got the tower card scorpio energy here some of y'all this person here could be a scorpio so as i mentioned here whatever took place in the past that was exposed here something had to fall down something had to be destroyed so something new can circle back around and be built or established here okay let's clarify the tower this could have been a situation with the person here on your mind where they may have found out some things here that they wasn't happy with or was exposed some things that they needed to see. And I'm sure that you need to see as well. And once that was being addressed here or brought to the light here, it may have, of course, caused conflicts. I feel like Libra between you two for a time being for whatever situation or circumstance to uh, let itself out and be able to see now you know, how are you two both going to respond to this situation? How is it going to be moving forward here in the future, right? Let's clarify the tower. Clarify the tower here for Libra. Placements, please. Why do we have the tower energy here for Libra? Again, this could be a Scorpio, a Sagittarius, a Libra, Aquarius, all right, a Gemini, and or a Taurus. All right, we got the Six of Pentacles here, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo energy here. And then we have the Four of Wands. Again, Fire Elements here, Leo, Aquarius, Gemini. I'm hearing again, Sagittarius. And then we have the World card, okay? Yeah, so there was a situation with the relationship. I feel like either that you were in in the past or this person was in in the past where they felt like they were not given the even exchange opportunities with this person due to whatever behavior patterns that put that situation where it needed to go in order for this end to come and the justice for the new beginning here. So I feel like this person maybe was in a space where they maybe wasn't available, but you were available, Libra, or you wasn't available and they were available. Something in that perspective here, again, this is a general, a general reading, so I cannot make this personal. So again, just take what resonates for you. But there was a situation where either you or this person was available and the other wasn't. 
And I feel like uh, even if they were available, they wasn't per hundred percent making themselves available. Let's just say to you, because obviously you felt like you were being treated unfair in this situation, which you were because the justice court wouldn't be here if that was the case. Okay. Even the universe is aware of this here. Right. So because of that here, now that something had ended that someone was holding on to. So I feel like your person maybe was holding on to maybe another relationship with someone else. Maybe waiting on that. Trying to see if that was going to work out or what was going to happen or what was going to take place there. And they waited and they waited and they waited. And then boom, this tower situation hit reality check here that look no this was only being a waiting process for everything to end here because this person already seen the truth out of this situation this relationship this commitment here and this was just confirmation for this person after whatever maybe was exposed to this person here to see the reality see what they maybe was trying to deny and not wanting to see the truth of of this connection this relationship and now that they've been able to see what their truth was here all right. Now this maybe ha allowed this person to kind of step away from this. Of course, I'm sure they wasn't happy about this, but this is a situation that it was going to happen regardless because of all the major arcanas here. And then you even have two more major arcanas that came out. I mean, come on now. This was definitely not by accident for this to be orchestrated the way that it did and was. Okay. Let's clarify the justice cards here. Wow, Libra. Definitely, again, if this is resonating for you, hit that big fat thumbs up. Smash that thumb, okay? Show my ancestors some love for the deliverance of this message here. Wow, very powerful reading here today. All right, if you would love to book a personal reading, Libra, to get more insight, to see what the potential outcome for you and this person here is in the future, because this is definitely a lot. All right, just pertaining to the energies here that is at will and that force here to see what potential outcome for you two. We could definitely utilize the Love Romance Angel deck here to see what's the future outcome for you two here, okay? Yeah, we got the Magician here, Aries energy and also Aquarius energy for me as a reader. The Magician talks about, you know, getting your power back, taking all four of those elements and actually making something out of them and manifesting the lifestyle, the love that you want and desire and know that you are deserving of here, okay? Yeah, because this person, whoever this energy here is, again, they could be an air sign Libra, a Gemini, Aquarius, or a Libra like yourself, but they are aware of their behavior. They are aware of the position that they put you in in this situation here. The Eight of Swords talks about guilt, right? It talks about um, disappointment, being ashamed of themselves here, for this situation and circumstance and how everything happened and took place here. Clarify the horror fonts here, please. Wow, Libra. Clarify the horror fonts, please. We know the horror font talks about commitment, a marriage, um, seeking spiritual advice, trying to get an understanding of their behavior patterns and what happened and transpired here. Clarify the horror font here. Yep, the page of ones. So now you're about to get communication from this person. Some of y'all, again, this person could be a fire sign here, a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries here. But whomever this person here is, you're now about to get communication about the situation where they're literally going to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you because this was a lot that this person had to cope with themselves and process with. And it's like now they're starting to see that, damn, Libra had no parts in this. This was absolutely not fair to Libra when all Libra wanted to do was to appreciate me um, you know, look after me and be in my corner and, you know, understand me and give the love that I was seeking from, from someone else. Right? Yep. We got the 10 of wands here at the bottom of the deck. Sagittarius energy again, putting this situation to an end here. So it's like, as they've done this, they realized and looked over and they're like, wow, Libra's not here anymore. But wow, Libra was here for me the whole fucking entire time. But well, isn't that a bitch? Okay, it's crazy how the tables turn, right? So wow, let's see what they want to say here. I'm going to use my uh, famous Raw Tarot index cards here. And let's see what this person here wants to say. Wow. Yeah, definitely makes sense here. 
we got I went back to my past lover. No more sneaking around. It's you. All right. As I mentioned here, this was a situation that you were here for this person the whole entire time. And they done the things that they've done here out of the spite of, I don't know if they were just blind to the fact of still in this soul tie with this person that betrayed them numerous of times. And they tried to stick in and be in denial of that person. And throughout that experience, I feel like they hurt you throughout that experience and not realizing that or not seeing the truth for what it really was. The whole entire time where they were seeking comfort from that person that was not giving it to them. And yet you're here doing just that. And I'm not sure how this person didn't see that. But now they do. Now they do. Oh, you better believe. Now they see the truth in this situation. Now they see it a lot. Yeah, we got I think of you. Okay, they definitely think about you a lot. You know, and we got you been on my mind. Yeah. This is the case here. This is what's been going on ever since you decided to kind of, you know, step back, pull your energy back from this person here. Okay. They continuously now just think about you. They continuously now have you run across their mind, which I'm sure they will. You don't recognize the good thing until it's gone. Right. And now they realize this and now they see this for themselves. It ain't no fun when a rabbit got the gun. All right, but wow, Libra, I'm going to leave this portion of the reading here so it doesn't scatter too far out. But again, if you would love to book a personal reading to get more insight and details and see what's the best opportunity for you and this person or what should you do at this point? What's going to be the final straw here? Okay, wow, Libra, I definitely hope again this gave you the clarity and insight that you need here. All right, definitely. If so, again, don't forget to smash that big fat thumbs up. Show my spirit team some love. I couldn't do it without them to deliver this message here today. And again, if you absolutely love the content, subscribe. We would love to have you here part of our soul family. And be sure to be ready and adjust your notification bells for when I go live on this platform for all Zodiac sign readings. So that gives you an opportunity to check in with this person's energy on a daily basis. And if you would love more content, come on over to Patreon or the OnlyFans page. I love to have you there. We do give early access to all my content. You'll be the first to read and get the readings a day in advance before I actually post them here on YouTube. You also get free questions every time I go live for my Patreon family. You get free weekly oracle messages. You get weekly reports for astrology to be aware of situations and circumstances like this. And you always get oracle weekly check-ins with your ancestors for word advice, okay? I do make sure that you're over there suited and booted for situations and circumstances like this, okay? But thank you again, Libra. I appreciate you and I definitely look forward to your next reading. And I wish you and this person the best. I truly do. Bye-bye.